Hey YouTube Gundam here, welcome back. I have officially hit 43 hours of construction in-game. And... <laughs> uh, important... Uh, still not showing. I, I didn't... I cut off the other one. Oh, there they are. I cut off the other one, so that'll show, but... Uh, that I'm leaving, so yeah. Uh... Some important adjustments. Along with the heavy armor there, I've added some heavy armor here. I just forgot to color it with the carbon fiber. If you know me. <laughs> I do like how smooth that becomes. But I didn't do too much. But I believe this was heavy. Well, I'm going to call it heavy anyways. Confuse the enemy. I know this is. But not everything. Just about there. And then these, not that, but I'll do it to confuse the enemy. These, these. Some bits down there, but I'll not do any more to confuse the enemy some more. Okay. So, yeah, I actually put a lot of heavy armor on this whole section to uh, make the enemy have a harder time hitting the hydrogen. Uh, next, I've actually gone in around and removed the majority of my, uh, panels and whatnot. Be uh, where am I? Where am I? I removed a lot of LCD panels because CPU. Uh, I'm trying my best to keep the CPU beneath that of the Valiant. And I am currently there. The Valiant CPU is 115,000 just about. I'm at 113 and a half thousand. So one and a half thousand CPU less. So that's good. Um. So yeah, I, I've also um, gone and added some signs like this. I've changed the miners to be up here. Because miners and grinders being up here where this is makes sense. The welders on the bottom where there's nothing else there also makes sense. Uh, yeah, I added a couple of solar panels. I've added some. Hydroponics farms for backup systems. I'm thinking of eliminating those. Uh, where are the other ones? Around here somewhere. I thought. I don't remember. Uh, and one good thing is I added a firing range on either side. So people can come in. They can grab some guns. Start shooting these things. Go from there. I've been removing some of the interior turrets. Still have some, but I've removed a lot of them. Uh, a lot of the red alert signs are all over the place. I've removed all to reduce my CPU usage. Um, let me think. What else did I do to the ship? Uh, oh, I did remove one bow first. I thought that was a little heavy, so uh, removing one makes it a little bit better. Still pretty good up front, but pretty spread out still. Uh, oh, here. I've added a brig. Every big ship needs a brig. So the brig would just come down. Uh, I didn't put in a button panel, but that's okay. You just go so You have three crow units for some really bad people. You have a basic room here for one guy and a basic room here for somebody else. I've also prettied it up a little bit. There is a gun here for the brig, which I'm keeping that for obvious reasons. Uh, in fact, Added some beautification here and there with panels such as this, just to help a bit, you know. Uh, where, way up here, I believe. Yes. Our, uh, where are we? Where are we? We are. We are top of green, so it should be. Uh, ah, yeah, here it is. In here, added extreme beautification heading towards the. Uh, engineering and I added a handful of signs here and there because those were very low CPU and it looked good remove some more guns here what else did I add what else did I remove what else did I change um, well basically just going around the whole ship you know what forget these I went around the entire ship just uh, doing what I can to reduce the CPU usage from unnecessary things. Uh, I want some stuff, but I gotta remove a lot, and those LCDs are pretty bad for it, and there are a lot of them. 
So by removing that, it helps considerably. Um, oh, I've added decoys around, so enemies will shoot the decoys. There's a uh, eight of them on board. There's one of the hydroponics units hiding there. Yeah, there are eight. Why is it not? Is it really? Fine. Clear it. Yep, it was. Okay, there are eight hydro. There are eight decoys. There's a series of hydroponics. I've added some uh, uh, flames out there for the collectors and some lights for it. Now, I've even removed some engines here and there. There's a large cluster of hydrogen engines here. I've trimmed it down to just a handful. Uh, again, for... Uh, well, there's a few reasons, actually. So, you're definitely going to want those atmospheric boosters now for a planet. It's just nowhere near enough engines. Uh, I still need to do the command bridge locations, but I was starting to save up all of the... Um, all of the various grids and the groupings and all and i was starting to work on that so this is not my last video but it is probably my second to last video on the build process i just gotta do all the command grids and everything um uh, i was thinking about the lc uh, the uh, virtual room the holodeck whatever you want to call it down here because that is pretty nasty with lcds but I kind of want to leave it so you can have that. You know, I don't want to get rid of it. It would help insanely on LCDs because there are the big ones here. PCU is 50. That's 50. So 300, 600, 900, about 1,200 PCU. 1,200 PCU for the whole room. And I'm currently... uh. 113 versus basically 115, 113 and a half. So I could bring it down to 112,000 or even a little less if I got rid of the holodeck room. But I want to keep the holodeck room. So, yeah. Um, mm. uh, yeah. It's, um... Yeah, it's pretty good. Um, just about done. Just going to go over the ship a little bit more, remove a few other things I don't need. Uh, more of those red alert lights and red alert LCDs especially because that drastically improves my CPU usage. Um, uh, what? I, I, I was considering what else is a lot. Maybe the heat units? Oh, yeah, these are 50. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Well, as soon as you see that, like, this whole cluster is going to go. That's the whole cluster of those there and here. That's going to do something. There's a void here. Oh, that's maintenance. Right, 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 right. They have access then. That's fine. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Now what are we looking at? CPU has been brought down to one eleven three ninety five. <laughs> one eleven three ninety five. Because now I'm under twelve thousand, the sim room can stay. <laughs> I do have another group there, but I want to leave some of them. I won't leave some of them. Then again, I could just uh, keep one. Yeah, just reduction of PCU is needed. One, one, one. Oh, if I can get it under 111,000. And. One one. So, uh, <laughs> I just need to eliminate a couple more things. I can get under a hundred and eleven thousand PCU, which will be phenomenal. But now, yes, nearly done, nearly complete. A couple more bits here and there, and 
then the ship's done. Um, yeah. <laughs> the end is almost here. Thank you for your time. I'll catch you later.